this video I'm going to show you how I use a long line to practice the recall training. So I'm going to be working with this Doberman here. I've got a 30 foot long line attached to the dog and a long line is, is essentially just a long leash. I like the 30 foot length. I can always make it shorter if I need to, but I can't make it longer. Um, so for most situations I use 30 feet. The long line is super useful when you are at a stage in your recall training where you're almost ready to go off leash but you still find that your dog ignores you at times. So maybe your dog does pretty well coming to you in the backyard, but if you're on a hike with your dog, your dog is very distracted by the environment and they don't respond to your recall cue all the time. So what the long line helps us do is that when we call the dog, if the dog doesn't respond, I can pull the line and get the dog moving toward me. So when I'm practicing, I just move around with the dog, let them smell, sniff, do whatever they want to do, and then at some random point, I'm going to call the dog, and if the dog comes to me, I'm going to feed. If the dog doesn't, I'm going to start moving backwards on this line so that it catches and then gets the dog moving toward me quickly. Grace, come. Good boy. Good dog. So he came, and I'm going to go ahead and feed. And with recall training, I typically use really high value food. So I'm using cheese with this dog. He seems to really like it. Another important thing that dogs learn when you're practicing this is that the dog gets to go back to doing whatever they were doing beforehand when you call them. So the dog, we don't want dogs learning that every time you call them that some negative event is going to happen like you call the dog, leash them and then take them inside or you call the dog and leash them and keep them from smelling, sniffing and exploring. So that long line really helps the dog kind of move around on their own doing whatever they want to do and then you randomly call them. Race, come feed them Good. and let them go back to doing whatever they want to do. Race, come. Good boy. Good. So he's doing really well. So let's see what happens if he did not respond to my cue. So what I'm going to do is just toss a little bit of food out. So let's say that he, your dog was really interested in a certain smell or maybe they see something off in the distance, this is how you can use your long line to make the dog respond to your cue. We don't want the dogs to learn that they can ignore that come command. So if I take some food. Race come. Good boy. So notice how I backed away, the leash caught, and it was made to come to me. Race come. Good. What a good dog. Good boy. Race, come. Good boy. That's it. Good dog. So if you haven't used a long line before in your training, I would highly recommend going and inserting this tool into your toolkit. It will help you really improve the response to your dog's recall cue. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Good boy. Yeah, what a good boy.